Today we are unboxing Stripes. This is created by Naomi Watts, which is really exciting. You probably know her from some big blockbuster movies. And this is specifically targeted to women over a certain age going through menopause, even perimenopause, someone like myself, where you start to see those signs, things changing, not just with the skin on your face, but other parts of the body. And you may experience some discomfort, maybe uh, things are going on even internally. And so look, I just want to preface this by saying, this is not an ad. I am forced to uh, say that this is a paid partnership, even though I do not accept any money, I don't sign contracts. I I merely decide if I want to accept the gift and if I think it is something that may serve my clientele, then I will use it. If I like it, I will give you my honest review. So this is a hydrating and plumping facial serum. So let's unbox it, see what it looks like. I love the packaging, it's super nice. It says apply one to two pumps to clean dry skin. I am assuming this is pretty much um, as far as application process, just like any other serum that you would use, your serums always go on first. It comes with a nice uh, pump right here, which I really like because that's very sanitary. It looks like it is really a good amount. The bottle um, actually makes it look a little bit bigger than it is. That's a little thing that um, some people do. As you notice, you get a big bottle, but there's not that much in it. I think one fluid ounces is fair though. And, um, and you know, with serums, you can really apply them as needed morning or night. So it's water-based just to give you a little detail on that. So if you, I'm imagining if you are worried about using too many oils or if you have acne prone skin, that this still might be okay for you. Um, it does look like it's heavy on the hyaluronic acids and what I did read about it is that it uses a variety of molecule sizes when it comes to hyaluronic acid. If you are privy to hyaluronic acid in general and you've done a little research, you know that there are different sizes, right? There are bigger molecules and there are smaller ones. Now, by nature, hyaluronic acid does have a bigger molecular size, so it has to be adjusted. It has to be modified for it to be smaller. There are benefits to both. You will hear those argued back and forth. Oh, if it's bigger, it sits on top of the skin, it helps you retain the moisture. Oh, but if it's not small enough uh, it can't actually be absorbed into your skin and really do a lot you just hear a lot of uh, conflicting information on hyaluronic acid but the gist of it is is that it helps bring moisture up to the cells of the skin and it helps you retain it it is best if you apply something like this on clean moist skin about 60 seconds within 60 seconds of you getting out of the shower so that you know by osmosis that water is going to be evaporated and you want it you you want to be able to retain the moisture you don't want it pulling moisture from somewhere else from within your 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 skin right because you're trying to add moisture so that is the kind of the reasoning behind why you apply it that way but i guess the the how i interpret the difference between this one and maybe other ones is that they do use a combination of molecular sizes it says perimenopausal skin um, this genius ingredient uses smart targeted hydration to distribute moisture to where the skin needs it most Fair enough, it says created with five different versions of hyaluronic acid of varied molecular weights, as I was saying, uh, and characteristics to deeply hydrate menopausal skin. And so this is the deal, whenever we get, even, even before you're going through any type of perimenopausal symptoms, as we age, our body loses the hyaluronic acid that it normally produces. So yes, we already produce it. So that is why hyaluronic acid got, in my opinion, so wildly popular over the years because as we age, we lose it. And so this is, we're using it topically in an effort to replenish what has been lost okay so to me it makes a lot of sense it's called the power move now if it were me i would use something like this maybe once a day i wouldn't be using hyaluronic acid serum multiple times in every single product throughout the day because you don't ever want to apply so much that it actually has the opposite effect on your skin so if you're just using this maybe you would use it once a day or if you use other products with hyaluronic acid maybe you would save this and use it for 
for the time when you want to make a special appearance you know what i mean and you want your skin to especially look plump and glowy that's when you would insert uh, the hyaluronic acid serum which this one's called again the power move next up do as i do this is a vitamin c brightening and hydrating serum so let's unbox it let's see what it's all about again i really do love the packaging it's really it, it feels nice it feels convenient let's see what we have here uh, let's see how this is 50 milliliters so this is a bit bigger 1.7 fluid ounces again in a nice big uh, applicator again an airless pump which is always really nice if i were using it in conjunction with the hyaluronic acid that i already mentioned you would want to use this after now do you have to use these both at the same time uh, me being in the beauty industry for over 25 years i'm going to tell you no you don't um this may be the way that this system was designed this is water-based again which i appreciate squalane i'm a huge fan of i actually have a um, a, a, an oil called the glow oil and my glow oil contains squalane so i'm a huge fan of that and that's up there in the top you know five so that's a good sign glycerin is a humectant so that's up there also on the list so i really like that because glycerin is a different type of humectant similar to hyaluronic but it is different and it also helps you retain moisture so that is really good that they're using different humectants niacinamide is in here that's really great for your skin barrier so i really like that let's have some fragrance in here but i'm not opposed to fragrance antioxidant rich moisturizer so this is a richer moisturizer that hydrates and smooths the skin um, for a more revitalized complexion. That is what it says on the back. Packed with a blend of vitamins B, which um, niacinamide is B3, C, which is very common, vitamin C, a common antioxidant, and E that I just mentioned. Our formula helps to improve skin barrier function. That's where that niacinamide too comes in, along with just the idea that as we age, we lose, like I told you, we lose hyaluronic acid, we lose collagen, those elastin fibers start to weaken. So this, in my opinion, would be a good option for, um, for making sure that you simply are hydrated well enough as well as additionally protecting your skin with antioxidants because antioxidants help you protect your skin differently than SPF. So they help neutralize free radicals. So it's really helping you uh, prevent damage, that environmental damage. So I really, really, really like that. Good news is, is that if you do use this hyaluronic acid serum and then you use the moisturizer after it, since it has a different type of humectant in it, which is glycerin, that you would be doubling down on humectants without actually using over and over again hyaluronic acid. Third up is Oh My Glide, and this is so cool. They call it play oil, but you know, I totally get this. Uh, as I said, <laughs> you know, our skin gets drier as we age. Other things can get drier also, especially when you're going through these perimenopausal stages into menopause. And so this is really a pretty cool thing that they offered. I'm like, wow, somebody was actually bold enough to step out and say, you know what, this is, these are the challenges that women are facing and we are going to finally address it. So I love that. This is what the bottle looks like. Really sleek, really cool uh, packaging and bottle. It's 3.3 fluid ounces. Yeah, just a nice little pump, but that is, since we already opened it up, that is what the oil looks like. If you can see it, and let me read on the back exactly what these oils are, just in case you are curious. Grapefruit seed oil, okay? interesting and we have coconut oil we have shea butter we have castor seed oil we have avocado oil squalene again which i love parts we have the next one in line which is badge of honor okay my friend let's see if i can open up this one the right way it's like a little mini version of the bottle that i just showed you before which is really cute it's 1.7 fluid ounces and it's a hydrating and revitalizing gel so let's see what the directions say here with a powerful blend of hyaluronic acid 
and glycogen. This moisturizer can be used daily to maintain hydration. Water-based, again, like that. Glycogen, so that is going to be another humectant, but it's also using squalane, which I absolutely love. And now this one is actually using a form of hyaluronic acid, the sodium hyaluronate. So it also, interestingly enough, combines lactic acid, which I actually really love. I'm a huge fan of lactic acid because it's one of those acids that's actually hydrating and exfoliating, so it's great for sensitive skin. Huge fan of that, and then some um, preservatives here, potassium, etc. So I think this is really interesting for our other body parts, keeping them hydrated if you need it. If things are getting a little dry where you wish they weren't, then this is a really, really cool, thoughtful option as well. Next up is the Inside Edition. I love all the plays on words with these titles. I'm a huge word person and I think they're really cute and really clever. And this says daily menopause symptom support. It contains a probiotic supplement and vitamin blend. There are 60 capsules. Now this vitamin blend claims to help relieve stress, hot flashes, and brain fog. So I really, really, really love that. It has a proprietary blend of ashwagandha, probiotics, antioxidants, vitamin D, B, and E that all play a role in maintaining daily function and supporting healthy aging. Let's open them up in case you have trouble swallowing pills or you're just interested, curious. This is what they look like, just like that. And it says to take two capsules. That's the serving size. It comes with 60 capsules, which means these, in theory, will last you 30 days if you take them every single day. The box feels very luxurious. I really like it a lot. I love the color too. It's green. Now, this is a hair mask. I actually cannot wait to try it because I can't remember the last time I had a hair mask, but I have to say my hair has been so dry lately. I've actually used a couple of products from other brands. I've, I've done tons of TikTok videos on them, just trying to find anything to bring a little relief to, you know, my dry ends or just kind of the look of my hair in general. So that's one reason I'm really excited to try this. It, uh, let's see what it looks like. Actually, let's see what it smells like. If it smells like anything, let's see. Watch hair masks go everywhere. Oh my gosh, guys, this smells really good. Wow, it almost smells like some type of perfume and look how thick and luxurious that looks. Can you see? Look at that, really, really, really lovely looking. Let's see what some of these ingredients are. It's powered by two blends specifically of amino acids that improve shine and a trio of plant extracts that help to smooth and revitalize thinning hair. So I'm super, super excited to try this. Hanging out with me today. Please subscribe to my Over 40 Beauty channel so that I can continue to serve you. Now, I can't wait to go to work and use these products, so stay tuned for the next video.